right, what's going on YouTube? CardCuts2 coming at you here with a brand new video. This is going to be all of the pickups from the Indie Card Show we were at. This is up in Ship Shawana. If you haven't watched the, the vlog from that day, check it out. Uh, it was a video we just recently posted. Our guy Austin came in town and uh, was, was out there with us for uh, a day and a half, basically. Um, the the show was about 10 days ago at this point. It was about a week and a half away. And I uh, just never got around to filming the pickup video. Wanted to wait until the video was done. And then we had some different uh, changes we made at the video. So it took a little longer. But um, we picked up a ton of stuff. Only some of what we picked up is right here. There's an entire two-row box right next to me. That's full of stuff. Um, stay tuned for that. Just a little sneak peek. This is all stuff we picked up in that same deal. Right, it's full of some really cool stuff. So stay tuned. That will uh, I will show that here in a minute. But again, I try to keep track of like what I bought in my thought process. With that, I always like to share as much as I can. Since this one was ten days, this will be really tough because these got all out of order. So some of these I remember. Some of them I have no idea. Some of them were traded to us when I was out shopping. So the guys that ran the table, they might have traded for them. Um, so again, completely different. But um, I'll try to share as much as possible. This all right here was a big stack of graded stuff. I want to say it was like 200 bucks, 150 bucks. It was just a big stack of graded stuff, but um, I think it was a pretty good deal. It was a bunch of randomness. So real quick, you got a 90 Fleer Jordan. You got an Iverson top six. A lot of this kind of stuff will go out on our website. Some of this cheap graded stuff. I know the Jordans aren't super, super cheap, but like Ted Ginn was a Buckeye, right? This will go out. I and mean, this is probably a 10 to 12, maybe $15 card. Newton, SGC, JK for sure. Again, that, that graded Buckeye stuff is definitely going out in our shop. Uh, Henny went to Michigan, so definitely a shop card. This is a low pop. Um, PSA 10 Damon Arnett. Got something on the plastic case, but... Uh, Haskins, Rookie Retro, Wave, not numbered. Paris Campbell, again, more Buckeye stuff. Darren McFadden, cheap. Uh, and then another Jordan, 1990 Fleer, PSA 8. And then you've got this kind of cool SGC 95 Hoops Jordan from 89. You got a Minshew Select 9. San Antonio Holmes Tops 95. Julio Stargazing Gold. Another Julio Stargazing Gold. Uh, San Antonio Holmes. This is the box set. BCC G10. Then you got a BCC G9 Bowman Chrome Rookie. Chase Chronicles Draft Crown Royal. Another Ted Ginn 95 True Gem Plus. And then a Jordan WCG Gem Mint 10. So. That was a part of a bigger deal. I didn't actually seek that whole lot out. Uh, but when we were doing a big deal out, you know, he had the stack of graded stuff. And I, I just know that graded stuff sells in our shop. So I was like, you know, some cheap slabs. What do you want on these? And I think he said, I think it was 150 I think. Um, so I was like, the math just makes sense to buy it. Uh, this was tossed in a trade for a Manning Auto with some cash. I don't know if it's 6 of 6 or 9 of 9, I think think it's nine of nine. Oh yeah it is nine of nine nine years in the league so it's, it's a, one of the stat cards so it's nine nine of nine joe thomas you guys know i'm a closet joe thomas fan growing up in ohio i didn't i wasn't a never big browns fan but this dude's a stud and a hall of famer here soon uh yordan 10 tops this is the holiday akuna tops 10 then a guy I'm a fan of, uh, Joe Adele, tops, uh, or Bowman Draft 10. Um, this looks like a deal, I remember. Yeah. Don't remember what I paid. I want to say it was 120 I think this was all 120 So they have stickers on the back. So 10, 5, and 2. 2 or 3. And I think I paid 120 for all of this because there's one there's one down here. So these would have been two or three. Fred Van Fleet doesn't have a lot of cards. This is the Green Ice from Fanatics. That was a short print set. So a guy that doesn't have a ton of cards from an SP set. I figured this is probably 999. Again, not major margins, but decent. 
or not a not you know amazing dollars you're only gonna make five or six bucks but the percentage on that adds up uh ewing at a 49 usa hall of famer next mosaic first year mosaic just a lot i like about it sure thing uh chase at a 75 this is an easy 9.99 sale so to get that at that price uh jeter sapphire the sapphire set is great uh, again i think these are all double double up type deals uh jeter sapphire chrome uh judge with a pinstripe Easy, $9.99 or $10, that, uh, that'll sell. CBJ, rookie, Zach Borinsky, Young Guns. Again, another one I think will do 10 Next day, not a big name, but I'll buy any, you know, I'll buy a next day to show for, for 5 bucks of a guy from the last two years um, from a young team. Sure, $5, absolutely. Uh, this was 10 out of 149 So, again, got it in a discount, but the number one pick. And then MPJ, Donner's Black. I thought this was relatively cheap. MPJ sells well. One of one is jersey number. You know, one is jersey number. One of one. Um, I'm not the biggest MPJ fan. If you watch Card Talk, you know that. But $100 second year, I I think this will sell for $200. 2 250 I think it'll sell pretty easy. So, to get all this at 120 again, I think, you know, you're looking at 15 30 40 50 58 78 you know. You start getting there, and you're almost 100 here, and then two there. I mean, 300 on 120. Not bad. So I thought that was kind of a, a unique deal. Going to take some work, but still cool. Um, I think this was a deal. I don't remember what I paid on this. Torkelson Refractor. A couple hundred bucks. I don't remember. Um, then I got all of this in a deal. Uh, Elliot uh, Color Blast. Haley Deegan, out of 99, she sells. Jimmy Johnson, Stars and Stripes, out of 10. Uh, Denny Hamlin, auto, out of 30. Stanhouse, Junior, auto, not numbered. And then uh, Jimmy Johnson, seven times champ, out of 199. Some decent NASCAR stuff for either when we move or on the website, not sure. And then a Torkelson refractor. Um, again, not huge into baseball. This is not centered well enough to 10, I don't think. But um, may move that, may keep that. Not 100% sure, but... I, I knew it wasn't a super expensive lot. That's why I bought it. Um, let me see if this is a deal. Oh, this was also in that deal. Uh, Jackson Kowar, 101. Don't know anything about him. He doesn't sell super well, so I figured it's probably 75 to 100 bucks. Again, the guy that definitely doesn't sell a whole lot. Uh, then he got this lot. Again, I don't remember. He had 70. I don't remember what I paid, but I know he gave me a pretty good discount on these. Uh, Syndergaard Dynasty, four multicolored game use patch auto. Um, thought that was kind of cool. Thought that was cheap. Another one I thought was cheap. Syndergaard Tops game use patch auto on card at a 10. Ma New York stuff sells well. Uh, D Wade Sterling auto, 70 bucks. I thought that was cheap. I figured that's probably close to 100. And then an Ichiro quad patch multicolor at a 25. I mean, I just, I don't see this card not selling for 25 or 30 bucks. So again, if you're getting it at 12 in a deal and you're getting discounts on these stuff, I just I thought these were good buys. So picked those up. Um, got these. These were also in that trade with that that uh, Torkelson and the the NASCAR. Uh, Baisley Hollow 10 and Sexton Fast Break Purple. Uh, 16 of 95. So I got those. And he gave me a pretty good deal on both of these. I know those were both really cheap. I uh, picked this up in a deal. I don't, again, don't remember which deal it goes for, but this is kind of, some people have said this is kind of like the original Kaboom. Um, I know these have, these got up to like 10 to 15 bucks. That's a cool card. May grade it, probably a low pop. So we'll see. Um, Let me see, because this is, I bought a lot of stuff off this guy. Again, I don't remember. I wish I would have wrote these down because I this guy gave me some really, really cool deals. Um, this is some of it. I know there's more. I picked this up at a table. Got this at a deal. Charlotte Flair Auto at a 199. Again, offering something different. But this was just a sample. I bought what I bought off one guy. I see another Luca here. I see a couple different pieces throughout. Um, so I'll just go through it. He, I mean, all the prices were super, super, super. There's, they're, they're fair, I'm not going to lie. There are probably some really good deals. Uh, Dalvin, first off the line, at a 19. Um, 
Kirk Cousins, one of 19, first off the line. Uh, Aaron Rodgers, spectacular, 24 out of 50. Uh, checkerboard of TJ Watt. I think these are short printed. Watt sells really well. I got this at a pretty good price. Devin McCourty, two of five. Um, Crosby Genesis. Again, you guys know I got a kind of a crush on Crosby because he doesn't have any cards. Uh, Brady, first year. Bucks Uni, Optic Hollow. I probably overpaid for this. I think he said 60 or 75 at the time, and I think they were down to like 50, 40 bucks. So at the time, these were doing about 120, and I think they're down. So probably one I didn't do well on, but I definitely made up for it. Uh, T. Higgins, gold, mosaic at a 10. Um, I want to say he said 40 bucks on that, but I don't remember. This one, was, he was cheap on. Um, again, I didn't look anything of this up. Uh, you know, we were, we were just going through the prices one-on-one, -on -one and he's like, he would name a price, and most of them were pretty good, so I just bought most of them. Um, he said five bucks on this. I feel like this is pretty cheap. I have not looked this up to this day, so I have no idea. This could literally be five dollars, but Chancellor, I don't think, signs a lot, and the Seahawks LOB, the Legion of Boom stuff, sells pretty well, I think. Um, so I would imagine this is probably a $39.99 sale, maybe a $29.99 sale, somewhere in there. But for five bucks, I was definitely buying it. Uh, Toppin, uh, Gabriel Davis glove at a 15. Uh, shout out to 502 Frank, Jordan Nawara, Jersey Auto, J.K. Dobbins, Mosaic Variation, Prison Variation of C.D. Lamb, uh, Jordan Love, 5 of 100 Jersey. I got these for pretty cheap. I think he said 30 bucks for all three. I would assume these probably sell for 20 bucks a piece. Um, again, not, you know, not, not making a killing, but I would assume that these do well. Blue Ice Prism Rookies, all out of 99 um, from last year's guys, so, okay, not amazing names, still feel pretty good, Alan Lazard, that was super cheap, but we saw a lot of Packers, Lawyer Malloy Auto, uh, at a 35 for the Patriots, uh, Jeff Akuda, go Bucks, at 125, again, Buckeye Prism Color, Mahomes Laser, uh, DeAndre Swift, Team Color, the blue on blue, looks nice, at a 179, Cool card here. Again, being a Patriots guy, that's an old school Patriots jersey. Love that. Uh, it's numbered out of 50. So I think that'll sell. Uh, I don't know if these are from him or not. I generally don't remember. But Jordan Sterling with coding. Burrow and Burrow. We saw a ton of Burrow stuff. Uh, you know, he, he said five bucks on this. But he, uh, he's like, if you buy other stuff, I'll give it to you. Like these, both of these two cards. And I thought this was a pretty cool card. Two of two, Tyler Boyd Spectre. Probably not a big card, but I figured $19.99. I mean, Bengals are going to have some, some hype around this year if Burrow comes out and they get some linemen, but those are big ifs. And then Vladi Divac, International Men of Mystery, 10 of 10. Again, not amazing cards, but definitely ones I was buying for the price. Uh, this is a pretty good deal. Um, I have no idea what this is going to sell for, but this is super cool. Giannis, on card, mosaic, gold, 9 of 10. 1920. It almost looks like it's this big old sticker, but I don't think it is. I'm fairly confident that's on. Yeah, it's definitely not a sticker. It's a nice on card mosaic auto, to be honest. Might look to grade that, but not 100% sure. I'll go through these because I know those aren't part of that deal. Yeah, I think these are still part of the same deal. Burrow, Chase Silver, uh, Burrow, Tua Prism Variation, uh, Michael Gallup out of 99. Brady at a 75. He was cheap on that. Uh, D. Wade Chrome. I think this is second year. He was really cheap on that. Jordan Tops. No, I think these are the. Oh, yeah, these are a different deal. I showed this in the video. I think it was just these. The original video. I think I bought this lot. I think I said 370. This is kind of cool. He talked about this card. Actually sold me on this. Kobe rookie at a 2500. Anthony Edwards Prism. First off the line auto. Durant first year Prism, which actually looks pretty clean. D Wade early jersey, D Wade early chrome, and then Jordan tops. I want to say it was 370, so I thought that was kind of a nice lot. Uh, LBJ Slam, nice Haskins patch at a 25. Nick Bosa, glove or cleat card, whatever, uh, jersey number at a 97. Uh, Luca Maestro, gold, not numbered, but still cool. Uh, Hunter, 
uh, that's the Fanatics. Uh, Curry Blue, 249. And then Luca Team Color. Actually, on one of these is a BGS 10. This is at 299. So it doesn't look as good as a BGS 10. But it's still a cool Luca card. All right. Uh, got these in a big deal. Uh, LeBron James, Cracked Ice. It's a PSA 8, but still, I love the Cracked Ice. That's one of my favorite parallels. And then a Baisley Auto 1010 from Court Kings. I think that's a that's a cool card. Number to 149. Love this card. Justin Jefferson Mosaic Genesis PSA 10. Looks great with the team colors. I mean, they almost... I mean, that card really pops. Doesn't do it justice in person, but got that. I actually got that off the guy that had all that cool stuff like the Giannis and all the stuff I just showed. And I'm sure there's more in these piles from him. Um... There are, there's a bunch of stuff like this that you'll see. I don't know if it's in this pile. I think it's right here. Yeah. I think it's a lot of this stuff. So I think a lot of these were off a guy. Uh, a guy I think I, he said, if you watched the vlog, I think he said 100. And he added a couple cards. He's like, let's just call it 100. I think a lot of this stuff is off that gentleman. He was really easy to deal with. He had some really good three, uh, twos, threes, fives, tens boxes maybe, but I think I want to I want to say I paid about five bucks for a lot of these. Some of them might have been as low as two, but most of these I think are five a piece. So, but he gave me a pretty good deal. I mean, I think I only paid a hundred bucks for the whole stack. It looks like a whole stack all from him. So, let's just call it a hundred bucks for everything here and see what you guys think. Uh, Stockton Authentics. Out of 200, again, Hall of Famer, early numbered stuff. Uh, this is what, 0102? Yeah, 0102. Stockton at a 250. Jordan, I mean, pretty clean copy of the Fleer. Probably going to grade that and get it back in a year type deal. Uh, Mark Folds, Optic Hollow. Nick Van Exel Auto at a 25. Sure, a Lakers Auto, cheap enough. I'll take that. Um, Precious. Uh, Memphis Cracked Ice at a 23. And notice his stuff kind of sells. First year prism, not a big name, but these first year prism silvers, even common guys sell for 10 to 15 bucks. So I was definitely, definitely going to buy that. Josh Allen patch, again, one of those ones that sell, will sell for 10. Uh, early Brady stuff. This is uh, like 2002 Tom Brady. That, that, you know, that's an $8 to $10 card. DPJ, I think this was two. I think this and the Brady were some of these, some of these were like two bucks. Um, DPJ, I mean, Michigan Auto, 8 to 10 bucks, easy. Another one of these Jordan. Uh, Original Kaboom type cards. Uh, T Max Sweet Sigs out of 99, 0405. Uh, Duncan, second year with that facsimile auto. It's not real, it's just printed, but it's second year. I thought that might be a sneaky play. I know some people are into these since you know the autos get so expensive. Some of these can sell for 10 to 15 bucks. Uh, Spreewell, Fleer Focus out of 100. Or I'm sorry, Fleer Box Score out of 100, 0203. Uh, David Robinson, Names of the Game, Fleer Genuine. Alex English, 86, 87 Fleer sticker. A couple of Big Ben rookies, easy, you know, 8 to 10 bucks. Larry Johnson, Prism Auto. Josh Allen, Prestige, second year jersey. Thought this was cool for $5. I mean, I'll take this all day. Peyton Manning, College, Tennessee, Alma Mater's patch. I mean, got to be a 1999 sale. Uh, Victor Robles, Topps Chrome, Refractor Auto. Again, don't follow baseball, but this seemed too good to pass up. Another one of these Stockton's out of 200 uh, KGEX jersey, uh, another Stockton. This one's numbered at a 199. Then you got another Stockton Fleer collection at a 150. Another Stockton at a 200. I know this set has blown up recently. The star date blew up, kind of came back down a little bit, but for a couple bucks, I'll grab Marcus Camby. I think it was two bucks. Uh, Ray Allen, Topps rookie, and then two KG Fleer Ultras. I think that whole stack was right around 100 bucks. Um, definitely some. Some cool things. I know it's not your typical Joe Burrow rookie stuff like that, but it definitely has some potential. Uh, I believe we took these in trade when we were there. Kobe Tops. This is a uh, this is oh nine ten. That's the last year of Tops basketball. Curry, Harden, guys like that, and that's numbered out of five hundred or no two thousand nine. The refractors are at five hundred, but that's at numbered at two thousand nine. And this is oh eight oh nine oh seven oh eight oh six oh seven. Kobe Tops. It's gold. It's numbered out of five hundred. I knew one of them was out of five hundred. So two Kobe Tops gold, those are kind of cool. I uh, got these in trade. 
Uh, LeBron second year tops, LeBron rookie exclusives, and LeBron tops rookie not centered well. Definitely doesn't look like it's going to grade super high. You know, probably 7 8 range, but still, LeBron stuff pretty easy to move. I bought this off someone. I think, uh, I'm trying to think who had these price tags. I know it wasn't anywhere near 25 bucks. That's why I bought it. So. Not 100% sure, but Burrow. This is one of those Dollar Tree cards. I know these yellow ones in basketball do really well, so figured I'd take a chance for a couple bucks with Burrow. Uh, I got this in a deal. John Randall, patch auto at 25. Old school Viking stuff sells really well. Um, so capstone, cool patch auto. thought that was neat. Uh, I got a good deal on this stuff. Um I got a pretty good deal on all of these. I want to say it was like north of 2K. Just north of 2K maybe. I don't know. Uh, Kamara sells really well. 101 Black Finite. Uh, doesn't look good enough to grade. Looks a little OC, but still. Uh, Burrow Scope. Uh, doesn't look terrible, but corners aren't corners look like a 9. So um, not sure. Have to look at it, but definitely like that for next year. Akuna game used jumbo patch auto at a 25 from Inception for a 25. I thought that was cheap. Uh, you know, Akuna's a star, so he's an easy guy to move. I thought that was a good price. And then this. Um, I want to say the last raw one did like 1500 and I think Dominguez's stuff is going to keep going up. Not a ma not major into baseball. I've been very open about that. But I uh, figured I'll buy something of him, throw it back, and just kind of see what happens. So... This is this is gonna be that for me. So, stash that and watch it. Uh, watch what happens. Uh, pick this up in a deal. I'm assuming cheap. It's not even a top loader. Uh, Aaron Gordon cornerstones patch auto. AG actually sells well. Uh, some more random stuff. Uh, Peyton Manning insert. Peyton Manning Bowman Chrome rookie. Peyton Manning uh, selects from 2016. Uh, I think that was a year they were all silvers. Manning rookie numbered out of 7,200. And then a Kobe Tops Chrome Fast and Furious Refractor. Pick this up. Definitely a shop card. JK all day. 13 out of 35 Ohio State book. Definitely one that ends up in shop. You got a JK all day. More JK. Nice Joey Bosa patch. A lot of the Buckeye stuff going in shop. This was a sneaky one. I think I bought this for five bucks. Denzel Mims at a 25. I think this will do 15, 20 bucks. Some of his stuff sells decent, so we'll see on that. Let me see if I can fix the light. Nope. Not much luck. Uh, Aaron Donald. This is the Dragon Scale at an 88 from Select. Joe Burrow jersey. Michael Thomas auto. Uh, JK. Look at those patches. Pretty sick. Brutus, couple blocks out of selling shop. Lamar at a 25. Uh, Joe Burrow, JK, a couple Kobe tops with the reverse dunk. Manning Black Diamond out of a thousand. And Manning Black Patch Auto out of 50 at the acetate middle. And then you got this big old two row box of stuff. I'll pull it down here just so it'll be easier. Now, this deal was north of, was just north of about 12K. It was like, 12.5, I think. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool stuff in here. So I'll flip through it real quick. All right. Esteban Floreal. It's got some writing on here, but ignore that. Patch Auto from Flawless. I mean, massive card. Massive in thickness, not massive in size or price. Clemente, uh, Flawless out of fives. He's got a lot of them priced in the back. We weren't close on prices originally, but he was willing to work with me on them, so that's how it ended up working out so well. Judy, 20 of 20. Dustin May, flawless. 101, patch auto. Really nice one here. Joe DiMaggio at a 15, Jumbo Legends bat. Uh, Wiseman, hyper auto um, from Prism Draft Picks. Then you've got... Uh, Bull Bull Patch Auto, 35. Mr. October, Reggie Jackson, 3 of 3, flawless uh, on card auto. Definitely a shop card here. Joe Burrow, Next Era Materials at a 35. Zion Liftoff, Zion Shockwave, 
Zion Optic rated rookie. A lot of flawless stuff. Uh, Dave Casperato. Uh, Elroy Face. Don't actually know much about him, but that's at a 10. Michael Chavis Auto at a 5. Calvin Biggio. Pretty sick patch. Patch Auto at a 20. Tyler Johnson. Collegiate Materials from Flawless. At a 25 with amazing patches. Nice Eloy Flawless Patch Auto at a 15. A lot of this stuff will end up on online. So make sure you guys check our website. The link is always down below. CD at a 35. Uh, Whit Merrifield, 5-star auto. Senzel, 5-star auto. Springer, 5-star auto. Thought this was Mike Trout. It's not. They look identical in terms of autos and, and same initials. Uh, Corbin auto at a 50. Shogo and Toro auto from 5-star. So there's all those. And then you've got, don't worry, it gets better. Dylan Cease, Edgar Martinez at a 10. Pretty sick. Austin Meadows, Moncada at a 3. Craig Biggio, JD Martinez uh, at a 20, at a 10. Uh, another Shogo, Patch Auto at a 25. Uh, Tony, got, is it? Gonsolin, don't know. Uh, Dylan Cease, Kobe White, Teddy Bridgewater, Jordan Matthews, Ebron, nice AJ Dillon patch auto, uh, Pete Alonzo, Keston Hero, check out that sick patch out of 10, Gliber out of 20. Don't worry, there's some cool stuff coming. Here's these ones I showed earlier Tatis out of 25 from Definitive. Uh, Sick, Andy Pettit at a 15. Williams, Greenberg, Barra, triple at a 25. Koufax, Diamond at a 10. Aquino, Diamond at a 5. Wiseman, Ticket, Die Cut uh, Auto at a 32. More Acuna, nice Acuna, uh, Diamond at a 20. Got a scratch on it, but still a nice card. How about a sick Tua Spectra patch auto? Out of 50. Vlad. Flawless Auto on card at a 20. Uh, Addy Joss at a 25. Don't know much about him, but he looks like a Cleveland guy. Some more Zion. Some more Zion. Some Kobe White. Lucas. LBJ. Go to the finals. LeBron. LeBron. That's cool. Magic Kobe Connections. All right, then you've got Kobe, Aaron Naismith, Contreras, Jaw, Jaw, Jaw. Some more Jaw Morant. RJ, Tyler Hero, Tyler Hero, and Kobe White. All right, so there's all that. And then... Magic Bird, uh, Dr. J, Triple, BCCG75. Uh, this is the Timeless Moments Auto from Panini One out of 35. Dennis Rodman, amazing photo. You got a Jordan, second year Fleer, BGS85. These have probably fallen off since then. And then you've got Brady Bowman 8. And then probably my favorite one, uh, Brady Flair Autographics, PSA 8. So, like I said, a lot, a lot of stuff that one. Appreciate everybody who made it this far. I know it was a longer video, but wanted to show everything we picked up, right? Obviously got some some retail stuff too, a couple other odds and ends, but that was, uh, that was it. So, um, stay tuned. More content coming soon. More pickups coming soon. But... That's all I got for now, guys. Peace.